Nice. I know, that is brilliant. <laughs> Don't move around too much. <laughs> it's, this is virtual, not real. Here we are in the Dinaletti chamber. We have just a few minutes to explore before we need to return to the surface. Unfortunately, you didn't get oh. your... Oh, I saw a bed flying. <laughs> yeah, did you see that? <laughs> it just passed. It's, it's a really different experience from, from going in on a regular basis, as I do, to seeing the virtual reality. It's pretty close, though, I have to say. So, um, you know, when you, when you put on this headset and you start looking around the Dinaletti chamber, it's a, it's a reasonably close facsimile of, of what we actually experience when we're down there. And I think it really will give people a good sense of, of what it's like. The VR app is actually a, a really awesome opportunity for us. As some people may know, the Dinaletti chamber is very difficult to get into. There's only about 20 people in the world who have ever been into that space. And so for us, because Homo Naledi is such an exciting discovery and the material is just so spectacular, we wanted to make sure that everybody had a chance to actually go into that space and see what it's like for themselves. People in places where these important discoveries are made don't get to actually truly interact with discoveries because their first language is in English, for example. Well, we've done this in three African languages that are common in Southern Africa. So the people who live in the region in South Africa and Southern Africa can have the fullest experience of being in the Dinaletti chamber with Homo Naledi. Very few people that speak my language that are interested in paleontology. Uh, so it might um, bring a lot of people into this world. I'm very excited. I hope not just the Botswana people, but all Africans, I hope they're going to be proud of me and they will enjoy this. And uh, the whole point of that is to just engage everyone, especially the Africans, to learn more and understand more about discoveries and fossils. The visual image of the cave inside.